I'm Callan Hobman. Here's a look at what we're following on this Wednesday. A Bakersfield man has now been arrested twice in less than two years for allegedly committing a hate crime. 33-year-old Adriana Chavez was arrested Monday morning for allegedly threatening to kill people in the Fusco parking lot on Haley Street in East Bakersfield. BPD says he was carrying a hammer and a knife while making racial remarks. Police say he ran away before officers arrived, but he was found in a nearby abandoned building. He was taken into custody without incident. Chavez faces multiple charges, including a hate crime. Now, he was also arrested for a hate crime in July 2021. He threatened employees at the King's Drive-In restaurant on Nile Street in East Bakersfield. According to BPD, he asked workers about their nationality and threatened them with a knife. In other news, if you need a little extra help with your taxes, the United Way of Kern County's Volunteer Income Tax Assistance Program, or VITA, is a free way to get some help. In fact, today they'll be providing free tax help to families in East Bakersfield from 1 to 5 p.m. It'll be at Mercado Latino and will allow community members to schedule appointments to have their taxes prepared for free. If you'd like more information on the program, visit our website, turn to 23com well, As we head into our Wednesday, we've got to get a check of that forecast. Let's bring in Brian Gallo. Happy Wednesday, everyone. I'm fast forwarding this into Saturday morning. Why, you ask? Because we're looking at a small shot of rain moving into central and northern California. Don't let this hinder your plans on Sunday. Trace amounts is what we are really forecasting, but more rain moving our way is fantastic. Air quality moderate. Uh, so those of you with um, any kind of respiratory issues, just hang in there. It's not too bad. And wind not going to be an issue for us. Single digits for desert areas, 13 mile per hour gusts for us here on the valley floor. There's seven day looking beautiful numbers bumping up Thursday and Friday and then a big drop in temps as we pull in this area of low pressure uh, clear today though that is some good news and as far as uh, mountain areas slick conditions with lows in the 20s stay safe and stay warm getting ready for a chilly weekend that's what's making news this morning we'll have another update later today